Hi everybody, welcome back to some Stalker. Uh, we're gonna go stir up the hornet's nest. Uh, we're gonna go fuck some military up. And it's not gonna be fun, I'm gonna tell you that much. But we're gonna get to see what the military do. But they don't like Stalkers as it is, and they open fire upon me, but you know what? I'm good at dealing with them. I'm on my way. Let's get into position to go fuck up the military. And also I'm running out of stamina. Yeah, they, they're not too pleased with me. We just stopped the bleeding. This is what's gonna happen with the military. Yeah, he's shooting at me from beyond that hill. This is a rather accurate weapon, though. We're just going over here, because this is an easier perspective to see this guy. Because he was shooting me from beyond that hill. Look how mad they all are. It's a good thing I'm accurate. Or her. Somewhat. This weapon is really nice, so... Yeah, they're mad. This is a good weapon for range, though. I'll tell you that much. Kind of missed that sniper rifle I had before, though. But that's that's still... We can use that a little later. It's unfortunate I don't have enough ammo for it. I'm sure there's some sort of stash or secret I could get. They're yelling at me in Russian. Let's run back here. Oh, God. The minute I got out of cover, I just... Got fucking wrecked. You know that that's that's realistic, actually. I will say that this is probably wasn't the most realistic way of doing this. Uh, whatever. I probably should have tried at least at night. To try to do it the right way, because uh, I just mowed down like the entire military. It's it's probably one of the least realistic things I've done all day. But, you know, as long as you're hiding behind a tree, and you know how to take advantage of the the absolutely batched retarded AI, then, you know, you can't lose. But, I pretty much cleared out all the military except for this guy. You want some? There you go. Kind of just let them wait for, come to you. Oh look, see I can replenish all those those energy drinks I I didn't use. Wow, the military really like their energy drinks. Really like them. As an unhealthy unhealthy obsession. What that does to your heart? All those energy drinks, all that caffeine. I neither do I actually, to be honest. That's, uh, you know, I don't even want this shit, actually. Fuck this weapon. Makarov can kiss my ass, and the AK-47U can also kiss my ass. And also all the ammo for it. Oh, these are the, um... I think this one... This is, this is the P rounds. Can this thing hold that? No. So, this, this is useless to me. So is that. I don't want- I want shitty ammo. I only take good ammo. I'm an ammo elitist. Boom. Oh, that guy caught me off guard. Like they even have a couch? Dude, the military knows how to live. Let's use one of our apparently scientific first aid kits. And I didn't really need to. Wow, that guy has the same gun I do. I, I like his style, but I took the scope for it, so we're okay. Wait, wait, wait what, what do you else do you have? Oh no, that, that was my shit. My bad. Anyways, mission successful. This could not have gone better. 
and more realistic. And they also have plenty of ammo rounds. I have a shit ton of ammo. Look at all this crap. Uh, but I want to take it with me and drop it off at the next place I go to. Here's an AK-47, which is, you know, really bad, so fuck that noise. And I don't want 18 millimeter rounds. And here's the briefcase we came for. Now we can watch uh, Trader get mad at me for killing pretty much the entire military base. That may make them a little bit more suspicious and onto us. Just maybe. As I said, I, I, I kind of regret it now, but then I just kind of saved over everything I did. So I'm like, oh, okay. Well, now I'm committed to this. So I've actually never tried to stealth this mission. Yeah, I'm skipping over the fucking... That, the... Uh, the red barrel. I'm not going to destroy that. Just want to open up shit. That's all I want to do. That all does nothing. Oh, we can see what's inside the guard tower, too. And also, you know, these guys. Yeah, they're, they're gonna have weapons. And other crap. See, they do have these weapons. D does that mean I can go, like, early in the game and just... Like... Kill them for- kill the military just for their weapons? I mean, they're gonna hate me anyways, later in the game. It's one of those things I'm just curious about. You could get, like, one of the best tier... Rifles. If- if you can basically goad one of them out. Okay, that was a repair thing. So what did we get from that? We got some useless crappy 9mm ammo. Uh, I already knew I had that. The wretched. Oh, I want to sell that actually. But we did get a weapon repair kit, so that's that's kind of nice. And my weapon does not need repair. So. Oh, wait, there's also... Holy shit, they got a ton of food here. And sausage. Dude, the military knows how to live. I now regret killing them. They must have... They, they just wanted their sausage. The whole time. Alright, let's head back. So my hands are like seriously bloody, I just realized this. I'm, I'm on your team. I Also, two of the military guys apparently have stashes inside the stalker base. Go figure. So let's go, let's go look for those, those stashes right now. I think it's on the second floor, to be honest. Nope, not down there. Yeah, it's second floor like I thought it would be. My question is, how do I get to the second floor? Or maybe it's down here. The hell? Oh. That's uh, stone blood, okay. So I guess this thing is up on the top here. Hey, Mark, get your ass over here. We need to talk. No, we don't. We really don't. Ah, oh, here's his stash. So, that he put a... Oh, these are 939... Oh, these are sniper rifle rounds. That is nice. We will keep that. That is a good stash. Okay. Let's go talk to the guy who wants me, uh... You know, I'm carrying around a knife and you're putting a shotgun in my face. We really need some help. Go on. I am... Fanatic. I'm, I'm filling in for the leader since Wolf left. Uh, a few marks came by here yesterday. Uh, they made some tough demands. Uh, okay. There were some tough bastards, I tell you. They come here, making serious demands. You got one day to clear this camp out. It's gonna be our new base. Tonight they're coming back, and as you can imagine, they won't be in a mood for chat. Okay, what are you gonna do? We're gonna step in ambush because a direct attack will probably be the end of us. Uh, they've got the fighting gear and everything, plus trained in tactics like you wouldn't imagine. Uh, and we've got all we've got here are little boys, so we decide to sit tight in these houses and make it look like we're done. When the right moment comes, we attack. Fighters like you are just the thing we need right now. Okay, I'll help them out. Uh, let's spend the rest of the time. Uh, let's spend the rest of the time preparing for the fight. Here's the plan. I'll put the most hopeless rookies in the houses and basement and tell them not to make a move, otherwise they might just slaughter our own troops. You and me and a couple other decent shots will take the best positions. Have an eye in the area around the fire. As soon as they come close to the fire, we let the bullets fly. Uh, so find a place, find yourself a hiding place with a view, and wait for my command. 
Uh, take a look around. Remember, your odds aren't as good in the open. Okay. Okay, so he's uh, giving me two places to go. I would like that place up there. Let's, uh, let's go get the stash here first. There's one right up there. There's like another one I think up there. Oh, no, 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 this is like, can I sleep here? Safe place. Ah, so I'm just supposed to find a place to go. Let's go just steal this crap. Are, are we actually gonna attack? Are they gonna attack or what? I'm, I'm, I'm in a safe place now, I think. No, this is not safe enough. Okay, now I'm in a safe place. Are they coming or not? That's the question. They're, these guys are just still just casually talking though. Let me just make sure I know what I'm doing here. Uh, destroy the mercs. Oh, an unknown group of mercs. Well, am I really needed for this? Or actually, look, we can just attack them from here. I mean, how, how bad can they possibly be? This is you. People, everyone here is just casually talking. Nobody gives a shit. I mean, I, I, I tried to go to the safe place, but... Okay. I'm pretty sure they see him. Though. I'm pretty sure they're vastly under-equipped in terms of range. Oh god, no. They're ranging me. Their strategies are working. I thought he was going to tell the little guys to just take cover. Because that didn't seem to happen at all. If you're still alive, on me. Marked one, get over here, we need to talk. <laughs> you're a real killer, Marked one, I wouldn't stand in your way ever. Yeah, something like that. FN fell assault rifle with some NATO rounds. A suit, Trillix. And that's it. Okay. So, um, I got a. Wow, okay. FN fell assault rifle. What it, what kind of gun is this? It's um, select to fire, self loading. Effective range seven hundred meters. Post this one, which is doesn't tell me anything. That's a nice weapon, and I even get a suit Trillix X four. What? Oh, 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 wow, that's an odd looking scope. It <laughs> looks like I put it on upside down almost. It's four. It's a it's a four X scope opposed to this one, which is I don't even know what the PSO one is. It's like uh, not as far, but this one has a worse looking thing. But hell, if I'm sniping, do I care? And I get I got a lot of this NATO ammo too. She's kind of odd, to be honest. All right, stone blood, more health. And I think that's pretty much it. Let's go. Let's go see what some of these guys have. Let's wait for the enemy. Stay alert. What? Okay. Oh, look at this guy. Dude, this guy has a SIG tactical. Whoa. A lightweight uh, assault rifle geared for urban warfare. Hopefully this takes this ammo. I swear to God it better. And it does. That is fucking sweet. Oh man. I, I'm so using that now. The AK whatever thing can go screw off. Uh, now I now I just don't know what to do. And look, he even has a really cool scope on it. God, yeah, just just I don't know. Hold this for me. While I go sell some of this crap. 
This is a really cool weapon. Yeah, so this uses the 556 ammo, which is really good because um, that means I get to just use it whenever I want now. And my outfit has taken apparently a little bit of damage, so I'm gonna go while I'm in there. Uh, I'm gonna go repair my crap. Or I'm gonna use one of those those outfit repair kits. Let's get that. You got the loot. I certainly do. Missions. Here's the box from the the camp. And he says, uh, "Thank you. We'll buy you a slice of bread." Here is uh, three. Wait, two thousand. Uh, so he's giving me two thousand. And we're square. Uh, by the way, the soldiers certainly noticed something was missing. Better get going. Okay. Well, uh, let's see what else you got. Right, come, on. come on, I want to talk to you. Come on. Fucking hell. Okay, there we go. Trade. So, uh, definitely keeping this. As a result, there are no rails to attach a sight or grenade launcher. But, wait. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Normally, this weapon did, doesn't have uh, rails to attach a sight or a grenade launcher, but this one in particular does. So, ah, man, dog food is more valuable than this. So, there's two kinds of grenade launchers here. Oh, but I can only use that one. Uh, okay. Yeah, he uses the M309 grenade, and this one is a completely separate one. So, that's unfortunate. I can't, I can't use that grenade launcher with it. That's that's alright, though. Uh, let's go sell some just a little bit of these rounds. And uh, the wretch, definitely. Let's go sell some of this crap. Now I have no idea what I want to do with some of this crap here. Not bad. Some pretty good stuff you've got there. I'm just gonna sell that thing because this thing uses uh, the same ammo. Wow, actually, holy shit! Oh no! Oh, it's that, that's that's practically my... worthless. I'll just put it you in here. Fuck it. Day. I even have this thing here. Oh, this uses the 556 too. This is almost better, actually. Can I actually use... whoops. Just curious if I can use this grenade launcher on it. Because... look at this thing. Okay. Well, I can't really. This one does slightly more da- I'll take the more damage. Of course I will, I'm like that. I'll t always take more damage. Okay, I'm going to keep this thing for a grenade launcher. Put one scope away. Definitely don't need cigarettes. Holy shit, look at all these fucking rounds I have. Oh my god. Which means this thing gets a ton of ammo for this. So it's full metal jacket or this one right here. So full metal jacket or PBIs. That's nice. Okay, so well now I got something for my pistol and it's actually going to be like... <laughs> That's awesome. I got an automatic pistol and it all works. All right, we'll take the full metal jacket rounds too. And let's see. Oh, let's go get the other well, guy. Good. Hunt. Well, hello there. All right, so this weapon, the FN Fell, I really should bring it with me. Um. I'm gonna leave the saga here. I'm also gonna leave a bunch of the rounds here because I can just come back for them later if I really need them. If I'm really running low, because I really shouldn't sell them. The med kits I want to bring with me to the next area. Uh, the saga I will leave, and also the grenade launcher I will also leave here because um, that's for the AK-47U uh, or that one, the AN. Or no, it says grenade launcher for. Okay, so I fitted apparently on a weapon that wasn't supposed to use it. However, I don't care. I'll just keep it there. I'm, I'm just assuming at some point I'll get possibly one that's better um, like the FN Fall I should definitely bring with me there's no question there's no question about that whatsoever and I think that's pretty much it for ammunition actually you know what we can actually bring this stuff with me because I, I am actually not that low but yeah I have a fuck ton of ammo for this gun look at that and I assume I'll find some more on the way so um, with that well 
Good hunting, stalker. We can just actually go... Well, there's some stashes here we probably want to check out. So, I will fast forward to those. Oh, I just realized I made a terrible bullet. This is 556 ammo. Uh, I don't actually have that kind of ammo. I have 545. I need to go get my uh, FN fell back. Whoopsies. It's a nice weapon, though. I'll say that much. Just think about it, man. Next time, it could be you in this place. <laughs> Anyhow, be extremely careful near anomalies. As soon as you hear the detector beeping, grab the bolts and toss them in front of you. Alrighty, talk to you. <laughs> I, I know what I'm doing, I'm a veteran. Alright, uh... Not anything valuable. Yeah. 556. This is also 556. I need a 545. Damn! Alright, that sucks. Let's just dismount that scope. Put that back in there. Uh, I, I don't even know if I should bring this with me anymore. Maybe I should leave the FN foul here. No, I have NATO ammo. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I, will, I, will leave, I will leave this one. But I'll bring the scope and the, uh, the other thing with me. That's a real shame. It's a light weapon, too. That's the, that's the unfortunate part, because my weapons right now are extremely heavy. Uh, let's see, what can I put? There's a PSO one. Uh, so, ACOG 4X. No, can't put that on. Can't put that grenade launcher on. What can I do? Let's be honest now. Uh, it's just some scopes don't fit. And you don't really know until you just try it. Can't put on that one. Yeah, this is the only one that fits. Fucking bullshit. Well, what can I put on here? Almost dick all. Actually, wait, I have to go put it like that. Can I put this grenade launcher on it? Nope. Wow, okay, so basically nothing fits here. Just leave some of this behind, fuck these things. That's, that's a shame. I wanna bring the weapon repair, repair kit with me at least. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'll find some other stuff to repair. Okay, now, now we're off again. All right, we're coming up on our first dash here. Uh, let's go check this one out. Uh, it's behind a gate. So I don't think we can really do anything about that. There's one down there, though. Uh, so we're gonna just see everything in monochrome because that's amazing to me. Fuck! Thanks. I, I'm too exhausted to move and I'm dead. Because I started using the medkit and stuff and apparently while I'm doing that, I can't move. That's great. I, I fucked myself there. I have no one to blame but me. Valuable. What? Valuable. I wasn't aware they'd just come back. What are, are they the military or what? Let's do my typical hiding behind the tree strategy. I guess it's everyone. Probably not, though. 
Oh, that's what I thought. Fucking military. They're everywhere. God, it's like they did the draft or something. Yeah, but they, everyone has amazing weapons now in the zone. And now they can now join the corpses of the many people I killed. Oh, here's one of the stashes. No, it's not it. Get out of here, stalker. Uh, okay. So, the very fact that this is not the stash I'm looking for means it's all the way the fuck up there. Which is, uh... Only good times. I mean, if you were hiding a stash, would this not be the place you put it to? Look at this guy. What the fuck did I just pick up? Uh, it's a thorn. Bleeding plus 88%, radiation minus 10. Judging by how many times I bleed... That does not seem like a good trade-off. Munishmoy you two. And... We'll try the other place now. Now we can kind of head up here. While we enjoy the nice rainy weather effects. Apparently, I cannot go into here. Maybe it's on that side. Oh yeah, I can kind of just I can get around this. I see. Uh, now I'm now I'm heavily monochrome, Cro monochrome, monochrome, as in the internet browser. All right, let's see what's over here. Fucking hell! Getting tired of it. Oh, here, here we go. And this has a couple of armor-piercing rounds, some chocolate, and these P rounds. It's a higher armor-piercing effect on a pistol I don't even use. Alright, off to uh, Barkeep. And with that, we are uh, back inside uh, this base. We need that guy to greet us every time we get in here. It, it wouldn't. It, it just wouldn't be the same unless he was here. Not much uh, occurred otherwise. Uh, so let's just head inside here and uh, go put our uh, crap away while my stamina comes back. I said, "Come in." Said, come in. Don't stand there. Said, come in. Don't stand there. They repeat themselves a lot. All right, and with that, my information might well be of use to you, stalker. Put a bunch of ammo away. We don't need this much. If only someone helped me. We're gonna sell the thorn away. Come here. I've always got something interesting for people like you. Okay, and I think uh, I think we're good otherwise. We don't need this many health kits either. Definitely the definitely I'm gonna just give myself the crappy med kits. Might well be of use to and the weapon repair kit can stay here. Damn, if only someone helped me. So, Martua, you brought the documents from X-18. Good, the situation is becoming clearer. As I expected, this brain sculpture is man-made. It's a Kamenov experimental emitter, and its components were made exactly in X-18. These documents refer to Lab X-16, where they sent some components. According to this, X-16 is located in the production complex area by Lake Yendo. The scientists have set up a mobile lab. Why did I fall? So maybe they can help. Go on. It ain't simple. You need to get to the scientists and find out where X-16 is so you can get the missing documents. So, you up for it? Yep. Great, I'll be waiting. Came here for the job. And he gave me some a gravy and that. So we can get rid of some of this. If only someone helps me. We don't need the gravity. Sparkler is okay. Okay, and so, uh... With that, I guess, uh... We're gonna leave it off here today. I mean, these are the, these are the only weapons I need. I have, like, really good weight management now, so... 
Uh, I guess we'll see you next time. Bye.